So number four then from the 2015 advanced higher maths. There we are. Equation of a tangent to a curve. A curve given implicitly. Four marks. Well, just like in the higher, differentiate it to get an expression for the gradient, then put the figures in to find the gradient and use your y minus b. So the first part is differentiate this. Well, x term straightforward, 4x cubed, but y is a function of x. It just couldn't be written that way explicitly. So it was given implicitly, but it's still a function of x. So it'll be 4 times the y cubed, but then multiplied by the derivative of y with respect to x. The 9 straightforward, 9x is just 9, but that'll be minus 6 times the derivative of y with respect to x. And of course, a constant disappears. Now, there's actually two marks for this line. One for dealing with the x terms and the constant, and one for dealing with the y terms. So there's two marks straight away. Now, one thing in this question, it didn't ask you explicitly for an expression for dy by dx, so you can tidy it up if you like, but all you really want to know is what is the value of this gradient at this point? So you could go straight in with the numbers. So it'll be 4 times the 1 cubed, I'll just spell it out, 4 times the 2 cubed times dy by dx, or I could even just call it m at that point, plus 9, minus 6 times, again, dy by dx, should equal 0. So, so far I've got, that's just 4 and 9 is 13 for the number part. Now, the dy by dx, I've got 8, I've got a 32, take away a 6, would be 26 for the dy by dx. So dy by dx will be negative 13 divided by 26 is negative a half. That's the third mark. Maybe I'll just state the gradients given by that. And the last part is just for getting the equation of the tangent. So just using the y minus the y coordinate is the gradient times x minus the x coordinate. And just looking at the marking scheme here, and the marking scheme has got the mark allocated at this point. However, there's a note that says that says published form would have the fourth mark at expanded form, not as marked, which is quite right too. It just means get that tidied up. So you've got 2y minus 4 is negative x plus 1. So whichever way you want it, 2y is negative x plus 5. That, I think, is the fourth mark, and so it should be, or any other rearrangement of those terms.